an update on the turntable. The turntable was connected with um, drawing pins underneath. They didn't work. So I've gone for block connectors on the top. At the moment, there's block connectors. There's going to be plugs in the future. I've done a bit of a boo because these wires here should be longer. I'll explain why in a second. Turntable turns. So you can connect up with uh, the top branch. Bottom branch. Centre branch. And you can turn the tip all the way around so it connects up. Need to ensure it's in a good good alignment. This was actually very hard to uh, to engineer. So at the moment I connect up with the block connectors. These will be replaced by plugs eventually. If I don't screw them on, the electrical connection is not good enough. So it's a bit of a faff. It's not in properly. Okay, let's, uh, first of all, we'll run the train all the way across the track. All the way across. Bring it back on. There we go. Oh. It's a bit of a long train, this one. So I just need to nudge it a little bit. There we are. Correct position. Obviously, this is this is the sort of train that doesn't actually need to be turned around, but it's the best running train I've got to just show the example. Undo the block connectors, turn the train around. If the train's going back onto the main track, I only actually need to connect these two connectors here. So I'll just loosely fit those for the time being. We'll see if there's enough electricity going through. There we go. And it comes off the track, off the turntable. Jobs are good in. Well, with a bit of modification it will be.